Hey. <laughs> um, I'm fine. And I don't want to come home and and start anything. You know, I, I don't I don't want anybody to be upset. But um your ex saw me today and approached me. And I was friendly. I smiled. I waved. I said hi. You know, I, I try to be a nice person. And, um, they told me they saw you with somebody today. You know, when you told me you were working and had to leave and... And they said they saw you out with this woman enjoying a meal. <laughs> and I didn't want to believe it. But... You have been acting strange lately. And I realized maybe I try to be too nice. So I don't want to see these things. And I allow you to walk all over me. Like a doormat. So, yeah, they said you cheated on me and... And I'm waiting for you to tell me what you think about that. Oh, you were out with somebody. But you weren't cheating. Okay, so let me get this straight. You lied to me, telling me you had work today. But you were out having lunch with some woman. Which makes it okay to lie. But you weren't cheating on me. Hmm. I'm just trying to get out of my own mindset right now. Because, you know, I try to be understanding. I, I try to be the best girlfriend. But then the thought of you cheating on me made me think maybe it was all for nothing. Maybe I'm not a good girlfriend. Just somebody to laugh at. <laughs> I wasn't having the best of days today. And when she told me that, what she saw, kind of just broke me was the cherry on top making me feel worse than I've ever felt before that the love of my life possibly cheating on me lied to me and I don't know how to feel I, I mean I had doubts in what she was saying but if you're admitting to not going to work and having lunch with some woman today. Then why? Why didn't you tell me the truth? You, are you afraid I would have been jealous? Did you not think of what I would do if I found out? Or did you think I was too dumb and wouldn't be able to find out? When but past you, I've been very ignorant before. Maybe if I did see you, I would have thought, oh, that, that's not them. They're at work. Or something. It's not what I think. That's such a cheesy lie. A line used over and over in movies and weird scenarios and... Oh, I think I need to sit down. I'm getting a little lightheaded with this overthinking. Oh. 
Okay, then explain it to me. Because I don't know what to think of this. You couldn't tell me. You couldn't tell me you wanted to go have lunch with somebody? A friend, I'm assuming, then? I mean, I don't think I'm the jealous type. But I don't like being lied to. Helping you. Helping you with what? Um, a secret. Of course it's a secret. Or are you still trying to think of an excuse? You have to come up with something good to make it seem okay. I'm just tired now. I've spent all day thinking about this and then waiting for you to get home. And now, I don't know what to think or feel or... What do you mean, a gift? <laughs> oh, you were sitting down to talk to her. To think of a gift for me. Just this random woman that I don't know is going to help you get a gift for me. When it's not an anniversary, not my birthday, I don't think it's a holiday. A co-worker. Great, so she works with you. <laughs> so, sitting down with lunch with this woman, a co-worker, that you see, I guess, every day. And I guess she wasn't working either. I think I'm going to be sick. Because I'm mentally exhausted. I'm tired of being ignorant. Of just believing everything. Just because I don't want there to be anybody upset. And I don't want to be upset. I don't like being upset. Then I get told that you cheated on me. And you admit to sitting out and having lunch and... Do you think I'm stupid? Because I'm starting to think I'm stupid. And tired. Ugh. You don't think I'm stupid? Well, I guess that just makes one of us. Are you going to show me the gift? Oh, haven't gotten it yet. That's going to make all this harder to believe. Because you can just run out and get a gift now and say it's the thing you were planning. Of course, I could still just be overthinking. I just want an answer. I mean, you have lied to me before. But they were small little things. Making sure my feelings wouldn't be hurt, you know? This, this is huge. And I don't know how to feel about it. <laughs> you want to introduce me to her. Your coworker. That you had lunch with. Well, I do love you. And I guess I should, you know, give you a chance. I mean, to my knowledge, you've never done anything like this before. And I don't want to believe that you would. 
So yes, I would love to talk to her. And hopefully we can sort all of this out without me crying. <laughs>